Hi guys, Nathan here from iMaker and today I'm going to show you how to unbox, set up and print using your Ultimaker 2 3D printer. These are the parts that come with your printer that we will be using in today's tutorial. The Ultimaker 2 printer, a spool of filament, a spool holder, an SD card preloaded with printable models, the glass build plate, and the printer's power supply. The next step is to load the spool holder. Make sure that you have the end with the three prongs. Insert the top prong like so, then using thumb and finger, squeeze the plastic tabs until it snaps into place. To install the glass build plate, place the longest edge to the back of the printer and push into the rear clips. Finally, rotate the front clips into place. The first time you turn on the machine, you'll be greeted by the LCD display showing a message that reads, Welcome to the first startup of your Ultimaker. Press the button to continue. Because this is the first startup, I will walk you through a first run wizard. Click continue. To level the build plate, you'll need a piece of paper about this big. Rotate the button until the nozzle is a millimetre away from the build plate. Now click continue. Using the thumb wheel located underneath the build plate, loosen and tighten the build plate by turning clockwise and anti-clockwise. Click continue and repeat this for the right hand corner. Click continue. Repeat this step but now use a sheet of paper to fine tune the build plate level. Click continue and the nozzle will now return to the first position. Now using the piece of paper and the thumb wheel located underneath the bed we will now fine tune the nozzle. Slide a piece of paper between the build plate and nozzle until you feel a bit of resistance. This is too tight. This is too loose. This is correct. Click continue and now repeat this process for the front left hand corner. This is too loose. This is too tight. This is correct. Click continue to repeat this for the right hand corner. This is too loose. This is too tight.
this is correct. Once you've finished, click continue. Now that we leveled the build plate, the next step is to insert the material. Please wait while print head heating for material loading. Insert new material from the rear of your Ultimaker. Push the filament into the extruder hole at the bottom of the extruder. And gently push until the printer grabs hold of the material. Once you can see the material, inside the guide tube, click continue. The printer will now fast forward the filament through the guide tube. Once you can see material, extruding out of the nozzle, click continue. Next, select the material you have inserted in the Ultimaker 2. In this case, we are using PLA. Rotate the wheel and highlight PLA. Click and then confirm that this is the correct material. The printer will read, you have chosen PLA as the material. Is this right? Click yes. Now your Ultimaker 2 knows what kind of material it is using. I'm ready, let's make a 3D print. Insert the SD card that came with your Ultimaker 2. Select a print file on the SD card and press the button to print it. In this case, we're going to print the Ultimaker robot. The printer will now begin heating up, preparing to print the Ultimaker robot. Okay guys, so that's it. By the end of your print, you should get something that looks like this. So this uses default settings and standard Ultimaker filament. You may notice there's a few problems with the print, like on the ears, and they're drooping underneath the chest. But don't worry, that's normal. This is a good first print. Stay tuned for future videos where we will show you how to use the Cura slicing engine to improve the quality of your prints. Have a good day, guys.